uh, subcategories or a lot more types of categories within the expenses. For example, you, you might be breaking out your expenses like by location or something like that. And then you got different expense uh, expense line items. You could have different expense accounts for basically the uh, the different depreciations, in which case you might want to group them together when you actually put them on the financial statements. You might have different expense accounts for the different types of insurance that you have. And for many of those different kind of categorizations, for example, if we had different variants of depreciation or different variants of insurance, then we might make a parent account, calling it just insurance expense, and then have our, our subsidiary accounts underneath it. And that in that way, in accounting software, the software can often take care of that by either presenting in an extended format where we see the sub accounts or condensing them. And that's one of the major types of things you, you end up doing with the income statement. The other thing you might do with an income statement if you, if, if you got this from accounting software, it's going to be in order by just alphabetical order within the expense area unless they use 